owe me, and frankly everyone else, an explanation for your behavior. I explained it already. There has to be more to it. There isn't, okay? I met Drew, and I thought, I like this kid. I bet Liv would like him. Maybe he could pull her out of her honestly damaging comfort zone. So, I started to try and set you two up. And then this Sam kid barges his way in. Well, uh... Don't even get me started with that shit. I don't know what's up with that. They barge their way in and mess up my finely tuned plan to get you out of the house. And what was this plan, exactly? Well, basically, I was going to tell Drew what to do. He'd become your perfect guy, you'd grow close, and eventually he'd ask you out on a date, and you'd feel comfortable enough with him to say yes. <laughs> you thought this would work? Well, now that I say it out loud, it sounds kind of silly. But Drew... He's kind of a clean slate. He'll do whatever you want if you're nice to him. That's a terrible thing to say. Do you want me to finish explaining or not? Well, my opinion of you isn't really getting any better. Viola threw a wrench in my plan. You fell for... her, right? As far as I know, yeah. She. And she rejected you. And I saw how that made you feel. So I decided, well, to fight her. That is honestly ridiculous. I wanted to do something for you. I hate seeing you like this every day. Eventually, I'm going to move out, and I don't want you to be alone. And don't say you have your mom because you know she's never here. I just want you to get better. And you know what's best for me? I shouldn't have said that. I had a plan, I lost control, and I messed up. I guess control freak runs in the family. Yeah. It kind of worked, though. Huh? I mean, you walked all the way to the park. <laughs> You're an asshole. <laughs> So, are we okay? I couldn't bear it if you were mad at me. Yes, we're okay. Just don't try to mastermind my life anymore. That's my job. Deal.